Hi everyone, welcome to DD Classes. In this we will talk about the topic of types of propensity to consume. First of all, consume is a conception function. I have already a video on it. Saving function, conception function, conception. What are the difference between the conception and saving? I have a video on it. In description, I have a suggested video on it. So there are the two technical aspects of the propensity to consume. One is APC and next is MPC. In this video, we will talk about APC. Average Propensity to Consume. What is the meaning of APC? It refers to the ratio of consumption expenditure to the corresponding level of income. That is APC equal to consumption divided by income. So, Conception divided by income. Inna conception erukko, adu kethe income erukka. Inna renditthukku ratio soldradda APC. That is average propensity to consume. Nama evvula income erudu nama vangoroon. And the income le evvula conception pannroon. Abdi inradda APC. Ipo or numerical sum pahakla. If conception expenditure is rupees 70 crores at national income of rupees 100 crores. Then what is the value of APC? APC yodho formula pahathik na conception by income. That is C by Y. C for conception, Y for income. C is value 70 crores and income value is 100 crores. So, 70 by 100 you will get 0.70 percentage. If you have income 100, you will get conception 70. So, what is the average propensity to consume? 0.70. So, 70 percentage of income is spent on your conception. If you have 70 percentage of income, you will get conception. That is the APC. Now, this is a schedule. Income starts from 0 to 400. It increases from 100, 200, 300 and 400. And conception starts with 40, 120, 200, 280, 360. Income is 0, conception level is 0. That is autonomous conception, C bar. Already one video will put it. And APC value is C by Y. That is, first value is 0. That is why here no nothing is there. And next one, C by Y. That is 120 by 100. You will get 1.20. And next is 200 and 200. So, in this level, income equal to conception. That is, break even point. Because both are same. So, you will get 1. And 280 by 300, you will get 0 0.93. And 360 by 400, you will get 0 0.90. So, as per the schedule, I am going to explain about the important points about the APC. So, APC is more than 1. That is the first two values. 1.20 na maga kadiche, second value. So, before the break even point, APC is greater than 1. So, when is APC equal to 1? At the break even point. When is the break even point? That is, income and conception are equal to the break even point. In that is, conception is equal to national income. So, APC equal to 1. At the income level of rupees 200. Income 200, conception 200. So, APC less than 1. When it is less than 1? That is, behind the break even point. That is, conception is less than national income. As a result, APC is less than 1. உங்களுடு இன்கம் அதிகமாக அதிகமாக உங்கள் கண்சப்சின் வந்து கம்மியாகும். Next, APC falls with increase in income because the proportion of income spent on the conception keep on decreasing. That is, APC falls continuously with increase in income. அப்பு உங்களுடு இன்கம் increase ஆயிட்டே இருக்கா ஆயிட்டே இருக்கா என்னாகனா உங்களுடு கண்சப்சின் reduce ஆயிட்டே இருக்கும். Next one is APC can never be zero. That is, APC can be zero only when conception becomes zero. However, the conception is never zero at any level of income. Even at zero level of national income, there is an autonomous conception. So, in the video, we will see APC. Next video, we will see MPC. Thank you.